So I'm back home now in SF and I forgot to bring a cleanser. I'm gonna steal my sister's. Going in with the gold snail cleansing foam today. I woke up with back achiness. I don't know if it was from the really long drive back since we did drive back yesterday. Spending a good month here for summer just to visit back home. But I don't know if it's because my body's just not used to the different mattress at home. I mean, like first world problems, but I woke up like super sore. Like I felt like I worked out, but I didn't know that. But I'm back home in San Francisco. And I'm gonna take you guys along with me on how a typical day looks like in SF for a local I feel like when you go tour a city versus when you live in it, it's so different Also, my face is so itchy right now. Yeah, I want to rub it and my eyes are so itchy But I know it will just make it worse because we got two dogs in the house and it is really making my allergies act up We are gonna hit up the marina today. The marina is one of my favorite spots in SF. Every time I come back here, if it's for like a spring break, winter break, or even just a weekend, I feel like I'm always out there at least once. It's just so cute there. Such a cute little neighborhood. Okay, doing some light skincare because we are about to work out and then I'm gonna come back and shower. So I don't wanna do the full steps and then have to wash it out later. But I just used a toning pad. Already instantly my face got less itchy. I feel so much better. I'm also gonna use the spray. This is the Anua Hydrating Toner and this also helps calm my skin so much. I'm gonna use some light sunscreen because we're gonna be like walking around in the sun outside after. Also some lip liner, just a little bit. My hair looks like a crazy mess. Okay. Water before I go. I'm also gonna have some blueberries. Okay, hair done, we are ready to go. That was one of the hardest classes I've ever taken because it was hit high intensity. That was crazy. I don't know how she does that. You know, you need to get a little arm when you finish. I already feel sore and it's only been like 10 minutes after the workout. We were gonna go grab lunch at this cafe that has good matchas and bento boxes. And we were gonna walk there because it's also in this area, but then it ended up being closed. So we're gonna just try to find someplace else. Dude, I'm sweating. I was like, how am I gonna get through this workout? I couldn't breathe. I was dripping sweat. I don't know. And we were lucky enough to that. get paired together. Yeah, they assign people to different boxing bags. Is that what they're called? Like different boxing numbers. Bag? The different boxing bags or whatever they're called are assigned different numbers. So people usually just get randomly assigned, but they put us together. I'm ready to eat. chicken salad we're at Sugla right now the Greek fry is sauce on the side and this is Irene's first time
this one over here doesn't want to walk, so I'm carrying him. Okay, I'm so happy right now. Just got back from doing a little shopping. I actually found what I was looking for. It's like manifesting, guys. Like, I was looking, and I was like, sundress, sundress, or top, and then I found it. I also don't even know what a sundress even is. In my mind, a sundress is a cute, flowy dress that you wear in the summer, and... I found two of those. This right here is this BB knit zip up. So, so, so cute. I wouldn't wear this with the bottoms I have right now because right now I'm just wearing black sweatpants. But I would wear these with a dark navy low-waisted baggy jeans. Put like a belt or something. Wear this. So cute. Chef's kiss. This was 20 bucks. And then the second thing I got, I only got two things, was this right here. It's basically just a silk mini dress. It's red. It has this like detailing on the bottom right here that I thought was super cute and flirty. It's also from Victoria's Secret. And I was like, oh my god, this is so cute. I want to wear this with tiny boots and a really cute hairstyle. I'm already imagining myself wearing this on a vacation. The only thing I was hesitant about was how there's these black stains if the camera's gonna pick it up right here towards the bottom of the dress hopefully i can find a way to get rid of the stains this is a silk material so i'm not sure if it will come out but they gave me a discount for it and it was only 12 dollars for a victoria's secret slip dress so good so so happy with my purchases for today okay, and then i got one more thing I got some big hoops from Forever 21. If you've been watching some of my other videos, I always have big hoops on. And those were from Forever 21. They lasted me for, like, since freshman year of high school till now. So, oh my god, that's crazy. That's eight years. Oh my god. That's really crazy to think because I still feel like a child, but... The hoops that I would always wear would be from Forever 21. I had to finally throw them out because they were starting to rust. I needed a new pair, so I went to Target and I got big hoops. But then they broke on me literally a week later. So I was like, I need to go back to Forever 21 to get these because I trust Forever 21 for my big hoops. That's all I got in my little shopping spree. I'm so happy with what I got. I can't wait to go home and wash these.